unusual. Oh, good. Stretch out a bit. I obviously have to go upstairs. We'll just have a quick peek in case there's a filing cabinet. Oh, did I not shoot you when I came in? I'm sorry. There's only so many zombies I can shoot at a time. I think I'm supposed to have come in from a different part of the house. Judging by the amount of zombies. Oh, darling, you sleep again. So cute. Locked, bathroom. I'm guessing I'm supposed to have come up and through the kitchen. Which means where I was going up was like really close. Now they're all open. Great. Uh, it's, it's you and Screechy Zombie. Come here. Um. Oh, oi. Okay. I don't need that. I definitely want to know if there's a limit on maximum levels because I'm pretty sure I've been at 350 before. Where am I at the moment? 288. Getting there. It's medical stuff. I don't need that. Yeah, obviously I'm supposed to come in through here. I have to go all the way back up to top. Oh, this is where all the end loot is. Sweet. Okay. This might have something. There's a little box on top of it too I can loot. Yeah. I have another schematic scene there. The funniest part is I think I'm getting extra levels from like the looting. Oh, not looting. The, um, the reading the books. But, like, I must be also getting levels from just going between places. Oh, this is a cracker book. I really do hope I find this eventually. This art of mining. Like, I just don't know where else would have it. Uh, that's good old wood. I don't really need that. I'll take more of these, though. The four bites will sell good. I'm hoping that maybe I'll come across a trader semi soon. So I'm slowly running out of space. I do still have my drone. Where are you? Where the fuck are you? I guess I haven't been using it this whole time, so I haven't been paying attention. All right, let's get all the way up the top. I find it interesting that there's two sets of keys in this place. One opens the doors and one actually fucking locks them. Because that was news to me. Which should also mean this room should be unlocked. Yeah, it's still locked. Okay. So I, based on the loot being downstairs, I have to assume I had to come in from upstairs. Books, no. Because uh, initially I thought maybe I had to come in from downstairs, but then when I saw it, I'm like, nope. Oh, I know this place. All the little books here and there kind of like sealed me knowing where I am. Okay, so down here we go. Is next? It's that way. What is this? This it's one or two trailers. There's a letterbox. Looted. I don't think I've been in here. Locked. I'm guessing there'll be a way to get in from up here this this specific trailer type is literally what I spent the first night on in this feral mode and if I hadn't have had it I would have 100% died fuck off snake bathroom that yeah because I had no idea initially that feral sense meant that they could like get to me like relatively intelligently at night so yeah I just kind of like climbed up this and I'm like oh I'll be safe 
Like they'll only occasionally come up if I make a noise or like have some light. Nope. Apparently uh, Feral Sense meant that they knew exactly where I was at all times and I was going to basically be screwed over by it. I should be able to maybe parkour out of this if I'm lucky. Not quite. Again. Yeah, there we go. Uh, let's go back this way. Uh, okay. Ooh. Obviously the way in is over here. Whoa, dude. What are you and you? It's a couple of schematics. <sighs> okay. Boots I don't need. Mm, maybe this? Do you have anything? No? Okay, I'm guessing I'm going through that place next. I am slowly working into town, so I'll just throw that there and grab a swig of water. Okay. Actually, hold on. Apparently that swig of water made me cough. I'm like, you guys don't need to hear that. I think that takes me up there, but there's nothing on there. Oh my. Oh, fuel. I do like the fact that at least the rusty barrels 100% give you fuel. Maybe not be a lot, but it will be fuel. Oh, this is definitely Flanky's town. Uh, because... Most stuff still has something in it. Um, yeah, one of my bases was on this. And it was pretty great. The only problem was when I started doing modifications to the bottom, which actually strengthened it and enhanced it, it lost that top little section up there, which is so delicate. So the maximum you can possibly have is up to there. But it was a nightmare to build on anyway because everything wants to be like, you know, so many squares for... Uh, what do you call it, like a working table and stuff like that, you know. Um, there you are. I was going to say, there should be a couple of them in here. Hi, I'm I'm doing, hey, I'm, I'm doing something. Oi! Fuck's sake. You know, sometimes you just want to, like, clear out your inventory. Ooh. That's some good shit. Um, there's not going to be much throughout this place that I want. It's mostly going to be right up the top. I don't even think there's a couple of boxes outside here. Um, oh, that's right. There's a little office. Oh, safe. Hello. Um, okay. I want to sell these so badly. Obviously, I don't get to, but I mean, I wanted to. I should really just... Uh, I should have used my drone to hold some extra space. Uh, oh, not that one. The fuck is my drone anyway? I feel like it's like stuck somewhere, and maybe it got injured. Need to keep going up. Well, if it's if it's able to get to me now that I'm outside, it should be that way somewhere. Now ah, it's moving. It's trying to path to me. Must be stuck on something. Okay, there's loot up. No, I think I already did that. Loot up in here. This is always really hard for me to get in here with parkour. Oh, nearly went too far. Oh, a crucible fucking recipe. Never fucking forget the game where we spent we spent the entire map 
searching desperately to find a fucking crucible. And when push came to shove, we never fucking found it until the very, very last day when we had already resigned to the fact that we were going to start a new server and there was nothing much we could really do about it. Okay, so you're over that way somewhere. Hold up. Where am I? I'm literally on the building. You're in here somewhere. You said that you're this way. Oh, you're downstairs now. Okay, you've got to be nearby, right? There you are. You idiot. Come here. I've been wondering where this thing has been. I want you to carry some of the shit that I actually want to take back. Um, I do want to carry that, but I don't really need to take any medicines or stuff like that. I'll just throw the dice in there. They'll do. They give me a little bit more space. You take the stag chili stuff. Shit. Um, I think that makes stuff. That's just snacks, beef. Chicken doesn't go into recipe? No. No one doesn't go into recipe either. All right. So I'll just throw the medical into a second section and they'll do it. And just like tidy shit around here. That'll do. All right. That gives me a little more space. Now, where am I going? I guess I'm going all the way over this way now. So I'm going to go from row to row. It's all right, phone. I am actually awake. Um, I'm surprised I didn't have that turned off, but it doesn't really matter because, like, notifications and shit are turned off. It's just that, uh, what you call it, stuff like that push through. Anywho. So, um, yeah, I'm going to head straight across because I was going to do, like, I don't know, I guess if I went down... Went straight down and I came back up to here. I could possibly go past the trader. So maybe I actually do that. There's a couple of big buildings here. I'm going to need to swing past. So that way. Let's just grab. You're already empty. Um, that car might have some stuff that I can loot. Oh, I don't actually know the correct way through here, but it looks like it's all open. In various senses. Mm. Bathrooms aren't going to have anything. Be in and out for a few of these rooms, but I know some of them are interconnected. I also know that one of them has a dog. Fucking remember that. It's alright, so go back, go back to your room. There's, there's no disturbance out here and you can't fucking prove it. And it's not time. I'll buy another one of these. Yeah. Alright. Um, that... Oh, you work too. Okay. I can get behind that. Um, can you... Move items to loot container. I don't want you to take all. I just want you... Oh. Wrong way. All right, you two take that. I think that's the only ones that I took and put back. Not 100% sure with that. Um, uh, like something was here that wasn't supposed to be. But it should be fine. I'm, I'm also concerned with the fact that it's now nighttime because that's going to be difficult to loot. Let me loot this. Nothing. Calm down, love. I'm not ready for you. Shut that for a second. I'll let you come to me. Because that's going to be so much easier. Alright. I was hoping there would be loot in that room and I could, like, loot and then turn around and kill her. But I literally walked in and there was nothing. Obviously my gun is going to keep attracting zombies. Hmm. Uh, can I reach that? Yeah, it looks... Huh. Yeah, I think I can fucking tell who's been here. There we go. I don't need that place. I do need to go down to bottom floor, though. I'm really surprised there's not more zombies in here. 
Huh? Oh, double lootable right here. Yes. Yeah, so I really expected there to be more. Either way, it does make it very hard for zombies to get to me based on where I am. I believe I'm supposed to jump out there, but I'll have to come back to that. Since this is Flanky's home base town, I know that I'll have the opening on the ground level anyway to get in. Almost guaranteed. Get down. Oh, food. Go and finish looting. I think this room's the only one I haven't been in. Yeah, nothing really special there. I guess here we go. Here's some doors drilled out. Nice. Just enough bullets. Just enough to deal with what I had to deal with. Oops. I really need to repair this gun too. Just calm down. Okay, look, I need to I need to repair you. Can't take both of them because I need one at least. Wow. Did you see that fucking spiral jump up she did? Holy hell. Alright, I can repair this one now. I've got the second one. You're on that wall. So you you'll be fine. Ooh, oops. Get my inventory. I actually haven't seen a screamer for a long time. Uh, that's medicine. I wasn't finished looting that. Alright. Oops. No books. Oh, grim. Unfortunately, you didn't scare me. You should have seen the jump scare I fucking had earlier, though. Literally turned around and there was a zombie in my face and I just wasn't ready for it. Um, I'm skulking around your hometown. I'm trying to find a book. I'm trying to find the Magnum Enforcer 6. And I haven't come across it yet. Also, I don't want that there. Hint that. I'm only carrying like medicals and food and stuff like that and money. That's all I'm sort of carrying. But I'm going, oh, this is a cracker book. I'll tell you what. Oh, I candy this place. I'll just see. That's up, open upstairs, but I can get in here too. Um. I really only want to be opening up books, but I know there's a little office in here that does have some desks that I can loot. Why has it got clothing in the desk? I don't need that. Mm. Trash piles. All right, here's all the books. Good, they haven't been touched recently. This is a cracker book I haven't done. Uh, <laughs> no, I haven't, I don't think I've gone in your base for a while. I did like a brief like look through um, a couple of months back, but that was it. And then I've basically stayed the fuck out of there. Um, I have, on the other hand, discovered that Flanky uh, has looted most of this town that I'm in and has left stuff like, like a couple of items and everything. So I'm having to like remove them. Did I go upstairs? I don't know if I did. Yeah. So everything has like something in it, but the good thing is it's doing that thing where it, uh, if you take it out, it automatically replenishes it. So that's really nice. I think I'm supposed to go over that way. I don't need stuff I have. I really expected to get more, more book stuff. I guess. That looks like it's all downstairs. Can I get up here? Oh, there's another box up there. Ah, here we go. Ah. Yeah. Now you're already a grumpy old man. 
that. You know the hardest part about going from place to place, Grim, is literally not taking the loot. I'm only taking medical, ammo, food, money, and fuel. And I'm having to throw everything else out, which is infuriating. But I don't need it. And it's not like I'm going to be building anything. What I want to do is once I find this last book, if I find the last book, I might end up just decorating my house a little bit more if I find it quickly. But so far I've tried three separate days without luck. I've gone through every single cracker book that exists that I'm aware of, except for that one I didn't know was there. Um, and I have been going to traders and trying to get them from them. Hey! Oh, didn't know quite where I was, did you? You did. Well, smarter you are. Um, yeah, so I've tried like traders, I've tried cracker books, I've stopped looting kitchens. Um, uh, give me a second. Got a new bed. Oh, awesome. It's too soft for you for sure. Mm. I'm glad you got a bed finally though. Um no more no more playing games from your laptop on the ground. You you now get to like play games from your laptop from a fucking luxurious bed. I need to loot all of these. Oh, the desire to loot is still strong. See what I've got. I've got a couple of books. But yeah, I'm genuinely happy that you finally got yourself a bed. I know it's been like how fucking long has it been since you moved in there? Most less than a year, probably ten months. Playing from the bed, but it was a bit better since it was a bit harder than this bed. Hmm. Yeah, it's very hard to use a laptop on a soft surface because it kind of like wobbles around as you use the keys and shit. So it does not make it easy for you. I don't think I'm going to find a book out here. Maybe in the front office. If there's going to be one, it would be over here in here. No zombies. No zombies. I am still scrapping down wood. If I could take it, I will. Desk. Just a sandwich. I don't want a manky sandwich. Okay. Um, there is a space upstairs that I think I can get to. Tools and stuff. Sure. Oh, man. I look at duct tape and I'm like, I know that is a resource that is heavily needed. And then I sit there thinking I don't need it. We already made heaps of it. Okay, I think there's there's loot up here, right? Over, he over here somewhere. What? Uh, you got a wireless mouse and keyboard. Try on the foreign screen. Not. That's right. I just I don't know. I remember ages ago you were saying that you're like playing from the bed. And I guess I just assumed it was a laptop. But yeah, at least you've got like... Oh, I see you. Fuck off. Um, yeah, at least you can like play from the bed and stuff like that. You just, I don't know, 90% more likely to fall asleep now because it's comfortable. So when you like eat food, you're going to food coma 100% this time. I thought there was loot up here. There was no loot. Like it takes me to a different area, but that's not useful. So we're going to keep moving. Fred is just there, but he's not going to be available till morning. That place is probably not going to have a fucking book in sight. But I'm going to go over and loot the thing. It's Carmine. Hmm. Oh, man. Also, I have no idea if I'm going to be able to stream on 
Friday. That's going to be so interesting. Because tomorrow is the birthday stream. I could possibly be absolutely exhausted and just like end up accidentally like sleeping through. It's a possibility that could happen. But the other thing too is that if I do manage to, I'm wondering how bad my eyesight's going to be for PUBG. That looked like it was part looted. It was. Can't get out. How did I get so many of that? Repair kits are kind of good, honestly. I might keep the repair kits. I hate making them. Uh, now, there is stuff up here. But I think it's usually only food. Uh, oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, thank God. I was like, thought it wasn't going to replenish for a second there. I was so pissed. Getting that for it. More medical. Give you some food. Get out of my inventory. Okay. I'm going to just stow that there for now. It'll be fine. I'll tell you what. Let's not do that again. So I'm really just waiting for the trader in the morning. But over there might maybe have something. Yeah. Well, that's, that's the biggest thing is like... Oh, hello. Like, it's not too big of a deal, thank God, because they've changed the thing where it replenishes, luckily. But, like, it used to be a huge deal. You go to a place and you're like, oh, sweet, I haven't looted this place for, like, literally weeks in real world. And you go back there and it's all still semi-full of stuff. Or at least full of, like, one or two things. And it's just like, why? Okay. I can also get some good loot from these special loot bags as well. So I will be keeping an eye on that. I thought that would bring in more people. All right, well, it's almost... It's almost morning. The only problem is I'm not going to get anything... Um, I'm not going to be able to get to the trader until it actually is morning. So, I'm going to just put that over there and just start over here. So far, to let you know, Grim, I have come all the way down here, all through here, all through there, and I've come straight down this line so far. I want to hit the traders, and I want to go back up and through a few times. Um, I am literally going city to city now just to see if I can actually come across this book. Because if I do, it will be the very, very first time that I have 100% completion of a character. I've already done 100% completion of a map. Not this one specifically, but a past one. A lot of cars back there. I bet there's also a dog. I know that barbed wire usually hurts, but like my person doesn't get affected by it. There you are. Boop. It didn't boop. Oh, come on, it's so slow. I know you're literally straddling barbed wire and stuff, but come on. Boop. Oh, there's a second one. You see now this shit right here would scare the fuck out of me when I come in here. Ugh, come here, mate. The other guy can wait. I'll go through the auto place while I wait for Dawn to hit. I... Don't expect there to be books. If there's going to be books, it's going to be car related. Bathroom. I don't know. Stay down, mate. I really do hope that they improve the noises that the dogs make, since apparently they've improved the graphics that the dogs are going to have. I ended up watching that dev stream, but I ended up not watching like a lot of like the this is what the new graphics and stuff are going to be because I didn't want to get spoiled but yeah as far as I'm concerned if they're going to upgrade how the dogs look they should upgrade how the dogs sound maybe I wouldn't get so fear triggered where are you there you are I don't know 
Good old PTSD of being mauled by dogs as a child multiple times. You know, the funniest thing is they're like, oh, 